Hi guys and welcome to Peter Ray's Adventures. Welcome to my latest video. This video is going to be a charity shop haul. So items I picked up over the last week from Monday the 14th to Thursday the 17th. So what I'll do, I'll share with you what the items are, what I pay for them, what they're worth on eBay and what I've listed them for, if I've listed them. So... The first lot is three of these spud buds. They're all the healthy spud buds. Potato, um, sweet corn, and the carrot. They're customizable, all customizable. So you can customize Mrs. Carrot to be um, Mr. Carrot if you like. I paid one pound each for three of them at a local charity shop in, in um, Epsom. So the 2002 Hasbro, you can customise and take them off and this uh, and the other. I've listed these for £13. They're going for about £11-£12 with the carry case. But I don't have the carry case, so I thought I might as well shoot high because who knows, someone may buy them. You can take them all off, customise them for example. So a pound in my local charity shop in Epsom on Monday the 14th. So they're those spud buds. Also, let's put these back. Let me know also down below in the comments section what you thought about this video, what you liked, what you should bundle up, um, what you wouldn't buy, what you would buy, um, how much you would sell them for, for example. The next lot of items are um, some ties. So... I brought some ties again on uh, Monday the 14th uh, in Epsom, Surrey, charity shops. The first one is a CH Monday tie, sheep and striped. Um, CH Monday there. If you can see that, hopefully. There we go. I've listed for about 11 quid. They're going for about 10, 11, possibly 12 quid. The CH Monday tyre. Not a bad brand to pick up. The next one here. Um, let me have a look. I've got some notes on my phone that I'm looking through as well. Oh, this Simpsons, Bart Simpson um, Devil tyre. I always pick up Simpsons because they're very good brands to, 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 to um, sell. What I noticed though in the charity shop, I thought, oh, that's weird. Let me know down below in the comments and that, what you think. What do you think of that? Oh, if I can show you. It says Wallace and Gromit and it's Simpsons. Really weird. It's got a Wallace and Gromit one and it's, got, and it's Simpsons related. Weird. And there's one down here that says Wallace and Gromit as well. So what I've done is... The tyres are going for around 10, 11 quid. I've listed for £15 this tyre. Just because it's got um, a Wallace and Gromit label on for some random weird reason. I don't know why it's got a Wallace and Gromit label, but a misprint on the labels or when they're sewing the labels in, some plonker got it wrong. That's what I'm assuming anyway. Um... Oh, and let, just, just before I forget, this one I got um, for a pound, one pound. Um, the Simpsons Devil Tie, one pound ninety nine in Oxfam. Because it says here as well, one pound ninety nine in Oxfam, gift aid thing. So, um... This one, I haven't listed as a yet. I've not seen it on the actual listings on eBay. It's got the correct labels on. £1.99 I paid. I'll probably list for 10 11 quid. The Homer one says dull. Dull! The Homer tie. If you want to know, it's Simpsons 98, The Rack. By Matt Groening. So, I always try and pick up different ties as I can, because some ties, as clothing sellers will know, 
they do um, really well, the ties. Let me put that back. So they're the three ties. They were, I got on Monday the 14th. Um, the next lot here, again on Monday the 14th, I picked up these books, Series of Unfortunate Events. Lemony Snickets. I, each one, uh, there's four here, from Oxfam. Did quite well at Oxfam Monday. 99p each. So 99p each. Uh, number one. The Bad Beginning. And another number one. Um, number four. The Miserable Mill. The Miserable Sin. And number five. The Ostery Academy. Or whatever you pronounce it. So... They're all 99p each. I know there's 13 for a collection of this book. You can get 14, I know that. There's also a slightly different book cover version you can get. You can, I think you can get them for around 20, 25, 30 pound a bundle, I think. Something like that. Or might be a little bit more. I picked up this one, number 13, for 99p about last summer. So I've been looking for him ever since, when I remember. Just, just before I forget, um, do let me know down in the comments below what you thought of these items, what you liked, what you disliked, what you would bundle up, what you thought was a good buy, um, what items would you price up and, and how much, for example, because I do like to, to know and share. Obviously, as you've seen it now, this video will probably be premiered. It's not going to be a long video, but... And that. So, the next ones I got on Thursday, which was yesterday. Thursday, the um, 17th of January. Already 17th. Or, geez, already like... Yeah, the 18th today. Blimey. Anyway, I picked up a couple of Nerf guns. This one is... Um, the Nerf Super Soaker Thunderstorm. It's not in great nick. It were. Um, I've got to test it though. Test it down here. Because if you pull out this here. It fills up with water here. And then you can fill it up. You can take... This off here by un unlocking it. Leave me two seconds. And that, and, and here. It's like, like a water cannon pistol thing. So you've got uh, some batteries that go in here. Um, I got it in Hook, which is near Chesington, yesterday, which is Thursday the 17th, for. Three pounds, if you can, you can see there. Not in bad condition, but it's still grabby, so I've got to clean it a bit. Check the batteries compartment works. Put a bit of water in it uh, and and spray it. <coughs> Full like James Bond. <coughs> I got this one and the other one because of the summer period. Where if you see last year, um, we had a great summer. And I'm thinking, if you have another great summer like last year, then Nerf guns do really well. I've never actually sold Nerf guns or Super Soakers before. I've sold n lots of Nerf bullets, but I've never seen any, like, worth picking up. They're all round car boots for, like, eBay money, especially my ones and that. So, first ones I've seen in a long time. Um, as, I, as I say, I've sold Nerf bullets before. But not Nerf guns. The next one, which is the last pickup I got, so I didn't get a lot, but is this little Nerf um, Fire Strike from the Nerf Elite. I know Ben Fitzpatrick has sold these for quite a lot of money in the past. This one I picked up for £2. I've got to check the bottom here with batteries and that sort of thing, the bottom here. And then 
this. You, you pull it. You pull it back. This one, it's got like um, one here and a couple you can put in, in here, which is a button down below. You press that and then these come out. This one for that one, the top. It's got um, a red dot sight, which is this one here. Like the, the mirror effect, a red dot sight. So I've seen many games like Call of Duty, red dot sight, you can see people. I paid £2, which you can see there. These are selling for around, um, let's have a look. Uh, about £8.49. So I may keep this one and wait for another few. Or bundle it up with the other one. Because this one's £8.49, it's worth on eBay on its own. With no bullets, nothing like that. This condition. Obviously, with bullets, it'd be worth a little bit more. But this one here, I forgot to mention it, is worth between about 15 to 24 99 on eBay. Com that's completed and sold. Um, so I'll probably shoot for around about 20 maybe. Possibly about 20 if if the battery's working and clean it up a little bit, clean it up, the battery's working, and I'll probably shoot for 20 in that respect. So, I'll probably look at some more Nerf guns. I'll probably list this singly, and then list this one um, when I get another couple or something, or bullets or accessories, because quite a lot of accessories you can have, for example. So that really was my um, charity shop. Just a few bits and pieces, ties, um, some spud buds, some nerf guns and lemony snickets. So, as I say, at the moment, the charity shops, it's all I've got other than Spot, Gumtree, Facebook, I keep looking at. I do listings, a lot of listings as well. So I'm trying to up my listings and also go around more places to get items. My ch um, car boots, they come back on at March time. So that's Mar the end of March. So I'll be around there more frequently, as much as I can. And hopefully you've enjoyed this video. Do let me know down below, comments below, what you thought of these items, what you liked, what you disliked, what you thought could be bundled up, um, any information about the ties, especially the one that's got Wallace and Gromit sewn in. That is actually not Wallace and, Gr Wallace and Gromit. It is Simpsons. Um, what, you, what would you um, list them for and that? And hopefully have a good rest of your week and whatever you get up to. Selling stuff. <laughs> um, do like this video, share this video. And subscribe as well. Sh smash the subscription button, smash it and whack it and turn those notifications on. So you get notifications of my up and coming videos and like it and share it, for example. Once again, thanks for watching and have fun. Cheers, guys. Have fun.